Hi there, Cancer, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for the week of June the 10th through to the 16th. I went ahead, shuffled cards, laid them all out. Let's see what's going on for Cancer. First up, we have the Ace of Cups in the upright, followed then by the Eight of Swords upright, followed then by the Six of Wands reversed, with the Queen of Cups in the upright, and lastly, we have the Page of Cups in the upright. So I'm going to go ahead and interpret this read for you guys. First of all, for the Ace of Cups in the upright position, this is a wonderful card to have as your overall Cancer. Uh, the Ace of Cups, this is beautiful energy. This is almost like a restart, a redo on the emotional front. Now, this can definitely happen uh, due to a relationship, uh, a, a budding new relationship or a relationship that feels brand new. Um, could be a uh, birth in the family, it could be uh, due to something exciting, a new creative project perhaps that you're starting or involved in, but this is something that's going to make your heart feel really, really good on the emotional front. So that's great to have as your overall. You're feeling the love this week, Cancer. <laughs> Coming right off the hop, we have the Eight of Swords in the upright position. Eight of Swords represents where we feel a little bit trapped, a little bit tight um, because of a certain situation. Now, it's going to be different for all of you. For some of you, this could be taking place at work. For others of you, this could be about your finances. Um, the Eight of Swords, the Swords represent our thoughts um, and communication. So this could be our own thoughts making us feel trapped, where we get into that headspace of ruminating again and again and again over a problem or over a si certain situation that we're trying to resolve and we can't seem to find the answer. Uh, sometimes th this can represent where there's people around us that are also sort of piping in and throwing in their two cents and making the situation even worse. So uh, be careful with uh, too much overthinking of a situation, Cancer, at the early part of the week. Now it's paired up with the Six of Wands in the reverse position. This can and point to a lack of uh, victory, a lack of success, a lack of attention in a certain area of your life. Now, this is probably taking place in some area such as work or finances or a special project perhaps that you were working on and things are things are not it looks like a little bit of a frustrating energy at the beginning of the week uh, dealing with something. So Again, it's just a general read, could be different for all of you. This could be in a friend's family home situation or playing out at work. Then moving on towards the weekend, we have the Queen of Cups in the upright position. This is a court card, so it could be representing a person. If it's representing a person, this is water energy, that of Cancer, like yourself, Scorpio, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, male or female. Now, it could be that there's another water sign here uh, aiding you or helping you on the emotional front cancer or it, this could be representing your love interest or this could even be its water energy your own energy the queen of cups is um, someone who's mastered her emotions she knows how to deal and process her emotions correctly so whatever this situation is at the early part of the week it looks like you're not really taking it to heart you're not letting it affect your emotions too much uh, cancer, which is a good thing, um, with the Ace of Cups being your overall energy, you're sort of in that open-hearted love energy anyway. So this could definitely be you yourself uh, being compassionate, caring, and understanding towards others. Or this could be someone, like I said, another water sign who is helping you to process your emotions. And the last card we have up is the lovely energy of the Page of Cups. You've got a lot of cups here. Page of Cups, again, court card, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, male or female. Pages usually bring in messages. These, these could be cute, sweet little messages. Can be coming from a younger person. This could represent your children or your grandchildren. Just sort of making your day, uh, you know, bringing you a, a single flower, telling you that they love you. This can definitely be a crush who is um, being incredibly sweet. I love the energy of the Page of Cups when he's in the upright position. This can represent an offer on the small, uh, a smaller type of offer that comes via a message first. What a beautiful week for emotions and romance, uh, Cancer. A little bit of frustration here at the early part of the week, but I think that um, it, it looks like a terrific week overall. So I'm just going to pull you an additional message here from the Chakra Wisdom Oracle cards and see what else. 
they have to say. We have self-worth, Cancer, self-worth. So remember your self-worth and everything will be fine. That is the orange chakra that corresponds to the others in our lives. People, it looks like you've got something really, really sweet and really special going on in your life on the emotional front. So that is your reading. I hope it helped you. If it did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. Otherwise, I will see you next week. Bye-bye for now.